Riding the waves. Understanding this dynamic English idiom. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to dive into a fascinating English phrase, to ride the waves. This idiom is not only vivid but also packed with meaning, and understanding it can add depth to your English conversations. So, let's get started and explore what it means to ride the waves in different contexts. To ride the waves, originally comes from the literal action of surfing on the ocean waves. Imagine a surfer standing on a surfboard, skillfully moving along the crest of a wave. This requires balance, agility, and an understanding of the sea. It's a dynamic and exciting activity, often associated with fun, adventure, and skill. In everyday English, to ride the waves is often used metaphorically. It means to handle a challenging or changing situation with skill and adaptability. Just like a surfer who adjusts their balance to stay on the wave, a person riding the waves in life adjusts to new challenges and changes without getting overwhelmed. Let's see some examples to understand it better. 1. Even during the company's tough times, she managed to ride the waves and lead the team to success. 2. 2020 was a year full of uncertainty, but we learned to ride the waves of change. 3. He's been riding the waves of the stock market very skillfully. For English learners, it's important to remember that this phrase is best used in situations that involve handling changes, challenges, or difficult circumstances. It's a positive expression, suggesting success in managing these situations. Avoid using it in contexts where there is no element of challenge or adaptation. So, that's all about, to ride the waves. We hope this explanation helps you understand and use this vibrant English idiom in your conversations. Remember, language learning is like surfing. It's all about riding the waves of new words and expressions. Happy learning, and see you in our next video.